What's up YouTube, ODST General back again with another Emerge NYC update. Uh, this week we don't have any gameplay footage, at least nothing that I've played. However, we do have some uh, tech demo footage uh, from the coming soon trademark. Uh, tech demo where you're going to be able to drive around town and stuff. Uh, now, I've got the audio muted, but uh, we've got the Doppler effect of the... Uh, there's federal cues and stuff like that for the engines. So as you can see on the little uh, graphic at the top left, um, when you're in that little cone, uh, the siren is much louder. So if you're in front of the truck and the closer you are to the truck, the louder it, it gets. <laughs> Actually, it's pretty funny because my girlfriend was just yelling at me because she could hear these engines and it sounded like they were coming from outside so literally the sound from my computer sounds like it's outside of our apartment behind my head uh, so it's a very odd effect it kind of has but it's pretty awesome at the same time um, although it might disturb some of your family members because they might think there's a bomb or something going off outside um, we've also got uh, cloth put into the game so you can see the tarp a little bit is waving uh, a lot more noticeable with the flag which has been added to the engine. Uh, it looks really good. Now this is not something that's going to majorly affect gameplay, but it's one of those immersion things I always talk about. Like I said, immersion can really make a game because, well, you don't have to be realistic to be immersive. Uh, immersiveness really puts you into that environment. It's what makes a game good because it makes you feel like you're there. Uh, you know, it's what puts you into that world regardless of whether or not it is realistic. Um, and so small stuff like this cloth and stuff, that makes a big deal for that sort of thing. Because yes, that cloth moves, it, it's affected by the environment around it. Um, so yeah, I mean, other than that, there's some uh, sirens and stuff like that. Now, ignore the white box buildings and traffic popping in and out. Uh, you guys might wonder about that, I know some people have commented saying our, uh, our building's going to be completed. I've seen in the, the tech demo footage that, you know, most of these buildings already have textures and stuff, and I've seen it where these cars aren't popping in like this, so I don't know what's going on here. Uh, I mean, this is basically what they've said is that the buildings will likely be white like this for the tech demo just so they can get a base reading on how the performance handles for the average user um, to see how the game actually plays in more of a minimal setting where, you know, you're not going to have a whole bunch of building textures and stuff that you're going to have to try and generate, just so they can see where the game's kind of going from there. Uh, so as you can see, there is, at least from what I seem to see, there's a little bit of stuttering here and there, uh, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything. Uh, I know this is a sh short update, guys, but I hope you enjoyed it, and uh, I will see you around for more soon.